my name is Greg Storey. I am the president of Dale Carnegie Training Japan. We all have to learn how to coexist with COVID-19. So why try and replicate the old work style? Avoiding crowded transport and elevators are smart ideas. Work from home in the morning, go in a bit later to the office to avoid the crowds and do the same thing by leaving earlier than normal. When you get back home, continue working. You get the same amount of work done in a day. We just need to be more flexible about developing a new work rhythm. Check your own temperature at home before you leave to be certain you are no risk to colleagues at the office. Avoid all surfaces when you're outside, like stair or escalator handrails, subway straps or elevator buttons. Wearing gloves outside makes sense, in addition to a face mask. Touching others through things like handshakes, pats on the shoulder, high fives are out. Bowing is much better. We need to rethink how we work in the office. Does everyone have to be there every day? Have teams rotate to attend to the office and have the others work from home? Hold stand-up meetings at the office to make them shorter and allow proper social distancing rules to apply. Have coffee breaks together to catch up on what's been happening in our lives, but always use social distancing. Bringing your own bento, your own lunch, reduces your exposure to outsiders at lunchtime. You can still eat lunch with your colleagues, but at a safe distance. Reduce the amount of paper which needs to be circulated. Make greater use of electronic document sharing and do approvals online. Enforce best practice hygiene standards. Avoid touching our faces, eyes, noses and mouths. Regularly washing our hands with soap throughout the day for 20 seconds, including the areas under the fingernails, between the fingers and up to the wrist are best practice. With your colleagues, allocate teams throughout the day to regularly clean doorknobs and surfaces like coffee pots, uh, elevator buttons, tabletops, photocopiers, mobile phones, whiteboards and marker pens. Keep well and keep safe.